Hello everyone. In today's video, I am going to discuss the concept of economic growth. Friends, our website is Rameshwar's IES. And if you want to explore more articles on the issues of economics, you can go on to that website and you can press uh, knowledge store uh, type of icon, right? And you can get multiple articles on various economic issues. Now, let us discuss in today's video economic growth. So, what is economic growth? This is usually a question put up by various students. Right? They become, you know, uh, a bit of confu confused uh, when they make the comparison between economic growth and economic development. In this video, I'm talking about economic growth. So, economic growth is nothing but in change in your GDP, your uh, production of your economy, if it is increasing, then you would say that it is a kind of economic growth. And production and income, both are correlated, right? You cannot think about income without production. A farmer cannot get income without producing anything. So, higher economic growth leads to higher production of goods and services and higher income levels of the people. So it is all about, you know, quantitative change and uh, people are able to get good living standard because they are earning handsome level of income. So every economy strives to get higher level of economic growth. But how can we um, uh, nicely define this concept? Economic growth is simply, if, if you see normal definitions, it is something like change of GDP uh, on the previous year. What was the GDP previous year and what is the GDP this year? Change in GDP, that is growth. But if you see uh, a right definition of economic growth, then it is a sustained increase. Sustained increase. in GDP, right? GDP of your country, there is a sustained increase. What is the meaning of this sustained increase, right? So, many a times what happens like, your GDP is increasing like this. So, it is a kind of sustained increase because uh, there is no uh, decrease in GDP at any you know, place. Many times what happens like GDP is declining like this and you, you come like this. So when you compare this point with this point, you will feel that economic growth is very high. But what is happening here? This is the dip year, right? And if you compare next year's GDP with this, you will see very high rate of, you know, growth. But that is not really economic growth because it is not a kind of sustained increase because in the last year uh, GDP has gone down and the next year GDP is something slightly higher than this one. So you cannot say that this is the real economic growth. So sustained increase in GDP is really economic growth. So economic growth uh, is all about you know change in GDP and you must notice that this change in GDP must be sustained. It's not like that you are having less GDP last year and this year you are having normal GDP and you are calling it growth. So be careful about it. In various examinations, such type of options are there. What is the meaning of economic growth? And they give multiple options. And we think that we are well aware about the meaning of economic growth. But this is not the change in previous, change in GDP on previous year is not that much good definition of it. Sustained increase in GDP is economic growth, right? And um, for the year 2021-22, India's economic growth has been found to be 8.7%. And our present GDP level means the GDP level for 2021-22 is around um, 147 lakh crore rupees, right? And um, if you see, 2020-21, uh, our GDP was rupees 135 lakh crore. And if you see 2019-20, our GDP was uh, around 145 lakh crore. So, 
if I am to write these values here, 2019-20 and 2020-21 and 2021-22, what is the meaning of sustained increase? I am explaining you here. The GDP was around rupees 145 lakh crore rupees. lakh crore and here rupees 135 lakh crore and here rupees 147 lakh crore so if you get the growth rate of this year 2021-22 the growth rate is 8.7 percent while growth rate for this year is minus 6.6 percent so you cannot call it really economic growth in the sense that previous year is the dip year and uh, if you compare uh, this GDP level with this, this means that we grew by very high rate, but that is not in fact economic growth. If you really want to see economic growth, then you should compare this value with this, right? So, okay friends, let us meet in the next video on a new topic. Thank you very much.